Hello and welcome to Gothic Reviews. Today we are reviewing Precious, The Golden Ring by Bedele from Lord of the Rings. This is actually Gollum holding Precious and I would have liked to see them put more of the actual ring design of the one ring on here because Gollum's whole body is wrapped around. And oops, the fairy's trying to come along too, but that's because she's fantastical. Yeah, she's... but I don't think there was fairies in Lord of the Rings. I remember she has to just sit this one out. Um, okay, so it's actually a ring. I'm gonna turn it here and here. Um, I got a size 13 because I wanted more. I wanted bigger <laughs> because I was making it into a pendant because I couldn't find a pendant of Gollum anywhere that wasn't like a flat picture. I like 3D art and. This golem is actually from, I'm going to take it off its ribbon just for a second. Um, it's actually from the Hobbit cartoon, like, what was it, in the 90s or 80s? Maybe by real back shape, memory serves. And that's my favorite golem representation. Um, I don't like it in the new Hobbit so much, uh, the representation of him. Um, the Lord of the Rings one was okay. Oh man, just because I'm doing a video, this little shit has to tangle up. Oh, there it went. Thank you, little shit. That's because the fairy is basically a type of an elf. When you think about it, oh. <laughs> if this is the ring, and you can get it any size you want. This was actually a really good deal. The company is Baddeley, and we're going to put a link up. And I got this ring itself from Baddeley on eBay, and it was only $50 at Sterling Silver. Um, I don't wear a size 13 by any stretch, but I was getting it for a pendant. Um, because you can turn it into a pendant and have it as a pendant or a ring, which I think is neat because I actually wanted a golem pendant. But as you can see, his back, his feet are back there. His whole body is stretched out along the ring like he's like it's a giant body-sized ring, and he's doing a, a body hug. He's just laying on the bastard. <laughs> he's just like <laughs> laying down on the ring, um, and his head is there in full 3D detail, and his hands are here, and you can see the little ridges on his back and. Um, just trying to get the full ring view and here's the bottom of the ring it's lightweight it's smooth it's very comfortable um they're all their jewelry that i have seen has been comfortable this is lightweight but very well made and sturdy and um that's it is a ring and it has these little openings in the sides where his hands are separated right here and um that's where i put the ribbon so you just you don't even need to untie the ribbon if you want a good sturdy way. Watch this. Is right here. That's how you turn it into a pendant. You just stick the ribbon through the hole and then pull it through. And then put him through it. And loop it around. And voila! Gollum is now a pendant on a silk cord. And I got the cord from um, just like Walmart or whatever. You can go to any crafts or like um, cloth sewing, whatever, and just get silk ribbon on a spool for like 80 cents. So it's not gonna turn or rust like a chain would, and he holds, he hangs straight. Um, I'll move the fairy out of the way for a better shot of just how he looks as a pendant. Um, so there you got your golem pendant, and if you wanna wear it as a ring sometimes, you can do that. So with my cool enterprising invention, it is very versatile. Um, I don't know that Lord of the Rings is specifically gothic in itself, but you know, the Nazgul are pretty damn dark, and Gollum himself just looks cool, and. He's all twisted and dark, so he's gothic. So we are representing and reviewing, and smog, of course, is cool. So whenever we do Lord of the Rings reviews, it's going to be representing more of the gothic aspect of Lord of the Rings. Um, and so this is our first Gollum. We have several cool Gollum things to show. And this is our first one where Gollum is with Precious. Precious. Please like us, subscribe, and make us your Precious. And leave any comments you like.